Hey, what's up guys? It's another e-commerce topic for today. So, I apologize, no? Ang tagal kong hindi nakagawa ng video because I lost my internet connection. And I just had to uh, fix some things muna bago bumalik ulit sa paggawa ng YouTube videos na mga tutorials. So, today, we're going to talk about how you can create your own Facebook pixel and install it on your Shopify store. Alright. So, the first thing that you have to do is download Facebook Pixel Helper. If you nakikita nyo to, it's a Google Chrome extension that allows you to check if mayroong Facebook Pixel na gumagana yung isang website, no? So, let's start. So, here's the process on how you create a Facebook Pixel. So, on your business manager, go to data sources. Then, sa baba ng data sources, you're going to see pixels. Just click on that. You're going to be redirected in this part. Click on add. Your pixel name. So, this one, I'll just put sample pixel website. So, type in the website URL that you have. So, I'll just uh, put samplestore.com since this is just a sample pixel now. Click on continue. And there you go. You already have your pixel. So, the next one that you have to do is set up your pixel. So, how are you going to be able to do that? No? So, just click on cancel. Uh, cancel, Then, look for the pixel that you have created. To. Samples or Facebook pixel. Click mo siya. You're going to see uh, what we call a post ID. Copy this one. Go to your Shopify store. Click on online store. Look for preferences. And then paste your pixel ID. And then save. And there you go. You have your Facebook pixel installed on your Shopify store. And all you have to do is go to your website. Pag nag-glow to or umilaw to na kulay blue, that means na gumagana yung Facebook pixel mo. So I'll give you an example no? on my um, website. On my Facebook pixel, so you're going to see. Look at the top right corner. Ayan, no? So this means install properly. Installed properly yung pixel mo. No? So that's it. So again guys, thank you so much for watching this video. And stay tuned. Drop in any suggestion in the comment section below.